Join us in this episode where we say goodbye to our family. <laughs> Don't go! <laughs> we complete our COVID test to get over the Queensland border and travel to our first stop, Tiwa Beach. We are all COVID free. Queensland, here we come! Woohoo! So we're just at the information centre before the ferry. I'm just gonna figure out what we have to do in regards to permanent and camping. We can't. We booked everything online, so we'll see what we have to do. And there it is. And this. And that's it. Let's go. What are you doing, Dal? Filling out the vehicle access permit and the camping tag. For where? Where are we going? No. Tiwa Beach. Oh. <laughs> we just pulled up at the information centre. About to get on the ferry. And then we're going to head over to the Noosa North Shore. And then that's where we're going to access the uh, the beach. And then we should shoot up to the beach to our campsite. But we'll take you along with us. <laughs> Nervous, big fella. Yeah, a little bit. Alright. Come on. Especially <laughs> after this truck's just towing a <laughs> van, like literally right there. We'll be right, big fella. Should be right. Tie down. Yeah, tires down. Yeah, oh, we'll just we'll just come over the ferry, and this is where you yeah let your tires down. But the ferry, what it costs us, twenty two bucks. Yeah. To get over the Noosa North Shore, so you come over here, let your tires down, and then straight on the beach, I think. So uh, we're putting the tyres on the van because it's got so much weight. We're only putting them down to, I'm going to go with 25 to start with. Yeah. Yeah, they'll barely out enough. Nick is a little bit nervous. <laughs> when he gets nervous, he starts asking lots of questions. I know as much as he does. So we'll just have to see how it goes. Just grab my hand. Not a bad trip in, eh, Dar? I don't think we spun the world once, did we? No, it's pretty hard. No, it's hard as, hard as nails. Anyway, this is us for the next four nights. We're going to do a bit of exploring around this joint and up further north, there's Double Island Point and all that we're going to go check out. But, what camping zone are we in? We're in Camping 4. There's seven zones and yeah, it's pretty, like, it shows you there's heaps of signs along the way and it'll tell you where the zones are, but it's such a cool camp. Love it. Yeah, right. And what's for lunch? Uh, chicken salad wrap. Ooh. And you bet. And also, it's probably worth a mention, it makes it a hell of a lot easier if you come on low tide, so check your tides. Oh yeah, good one. <laughs> Super fast. Yay! What? What did you do, <laughs> Mini? <laughs> You got it good. Why do we have kids? <laughs> <laughs>
Isabella. Ooh, 60. Oh, is that 50 or 10? Alenia with the last throw. Can she redeem herself? 80. We need a calculator. Yo, washing up. No way. No. <laughs> no. no. I got yes. smoked. Woo yes. 900 and Nick got 1,130. <laughs> Woohoo! Anyway, whatever. <laughs> Loser! <laughs> oh, Alicia keeps your word. <laughs> Rematch. Yeah. I think we're going to get the drone up in the air and show you the last of the light coming through, and then we're going to hit the sack, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. It's just another doorway to open up and see. What kind of lifeline will be waiting there for me? I need to bury all these fears and let them fade away. I'm not scared, I'm prepared to find myself again. I wanna fly over mountains, I wanna reach the end. I rise up from the ashes. Our little alarm clock has gone off. It's pretty reliable. Young Finny, but have a look at this. The sun's coming up. Right there. Not a bad window view. We're gonna wake up a bit and then we're gonna go to Double Island Point. <laughs> Thanks for being so reliable, Finny. So after lunch we decided to go on a bit of a drive to check out the freshwater campground and I may have had a sneaky shower. We love Double Island Point so much that we decided to spend the next day there. We got all cars all the way that way and then all the way the other way. I suppose we're going back back to the van and pack it up and then we'll, we'll get off the beach and then on to the next one I think. Have a look at that. Also, there is a reason why there's no drone footage on this one. It just didn't feel right putting the drone up there with all the people in no. here. <laughs> oh, I personally think it's a bit of an invasion of, uh, of other people's space, but anyway, that's why there's no drone footage. So, we're in the morning, we're leaving. We're leaving today, but there's, oh, earlier on in the video I said about high tide and low tide on the beach and this is why. That's the water. If you can see up there, there is no beach left to, to drive on. And 
and you can see the water line on our camp just here. So we're gonna have a slow pack up and uh, try and get off this beach when it's low tide. What do you see, reckon? Good idea? What? Don't leave now? <laughs> yeah, no way. <laughs> time at TY Beach and Double Island Point has come to an end. We're just here in the... Putting the tyres up. How'd you rate it? Yeah, it was really good. I really enjoyed the four nights. Love Double Island Point. The water was amazing. But yeah, time to wash off the salt. <laughs> yeah. Alright, that's it for this episode guys. We'll, uh, we'll see you on the next one. Cheers, thanks for watching.